Hello everyone, this is Taria from Hidden Truth Tarot, and this is going to be the Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign of Taurus. Taurus, this is your weekly general reading for the 5th through the 11th of August 2019. Alright, I'm pulling from the Energy Oracle. We have Door to Spirit coming up here, beautiful. I'm also using the Sacred Traveler Oracle. And Taurus, I will be doing your weekly messages with the Witch Tarot. And at the end of your reading, I will be pulling a Universe as your back Oracle card. All right, so we have Cleansing Waters. Purification activates vibrant life force. Right. Thank you, Spirit. Taurus, Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign, Spirit. Fifth through the 11th. Thank you, Spirit. Taurus, Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign, Spirit. 5th through the 11th of August. Thank you, Spirit. All right, Taurus, we're ready. Beautiful situation of the week, Ten of Pentacles. Crossing you is the Ace of Swords. Six of Wands in your foundation. Recent past energies, we have Strength. Cards are just wanting to fly. <laughs> All right, we have the Moon as your crowning energy. Beautiful. Queen of Swords as your outcome energy. New circumstance from the bottom of the deck. Your overall energy is the Ace of Cups. Beautiful, Taurus. All right. Let's start here. Now, we do have Door to Spirit, Taurus. This is a, the number 32 is a very powerful number. Uh, I, you see all these lights and these orbs here. Uh, Spirit is saying at this time, Taurus, you have all of this around you. Um, whether you see it or not or know it or not, Spirit is with you. Your angels are with you. They're helping guide you. Your spirit guides are there. Um, you, you are vibrating on a very high, high level right now. So very powerful energy. Um, we have cleansing waters. Purification activates vibrant life force. This may be a week where you may really may be stepping into your spiritual path. Uh, some of you may be purging, uh, cleansing, you know, cleaning your homes and, you know, burning sage. Uh, this is a time I, I really do feel like this is a very spiritual week for you. Some of you may be, you know, going to the river, to ponds, to lakes, to the ocean, where, wherever you have water available to you to kind of get close to that uh, life, so, uh, life force here. So, very powerful energy. Now we have the Ace of Cups here. This is all about your cup runneth over. This is, you know, an abundance of... I, I really feel like here with unconditional love, whether it's you giving others unconditional love or maybe someone giving you unconditional love, this is, you know, ultimately a really deep feeling of intimacy and love. This could be you uh, being showered by the universal love as well. Now we have the situation of the week, the Ten of Pentacles, and this is so positive. This is all about the good life, good wealth, security, health. Uh, another thing, this represents traditional family values as well. So I feel like stability and security and family at this time is very important to you. So, and it's a very powerful energy about your financial situation as well. I feel like there's a lot of stability here. Now we have the Ace of Swords crossing you. I see this definitely being in your favor, Taurus. This is a new beginning in clarity and truth, what's honest and what's right and what's just for you. You have two aces here. So there's definitely growth here. I'm getting a 
growth and abundance and expansion in your spirituality and your finances. Very powerful energy. And you have clarity now about which direction to go. Now we have the Six of Wands. And this is awesome. This is in your foundation. This is what's moving you. This is what's driving you. This is an achievement here. Uh, this is recognition, reward for effort. Uh, this is like victory, all right? So this has already happened because this is what's moving you forward. Or it, maybe this is going to happen in the beginning of the week. And this is what's going to, you know, drive you through the week here. So very powerful energy. There's a reason and a cause to celebrate, I feel, for you, Taurus. Whatever this achievement is, it's success, it's victory. Now we have the strength card coming up in your recent past energy. This is the energy of Leo coming through here. This is you being very courageous, having the self-confidence to go after your dream, uh, maybe complete a goal, uh, being just very courageous and having a lot of success. So very powerful energy right here. And for some of you, you're going after a dream. You're, you're making it a reality. Now we have the moon here crowning you. This is what you know and this is what you're thinking about. This is the energy of Pisces. Uh, the moon represents some, sometimes uh, maybe things are unclear, but I'm not getting that for you right now, Taurus. Because this is what you know and this is what you're thinking about. And you do have the Ace of Swords here. So you're able to cut through any confusion. So I, I feel that this is symbolizing here. Spirit's telling me, especially with you having the door to spirit, that you need to pay attention to your dreams, signs, symbolism, and synchronicities this week. All right? Uh, if, you're, if you're getting numbers that you're seeing all the time, make sure you look those up uh, and get the meaning. There's, there's messages here from the spirit world for you this week, Taurus. And I feel like with this coming up as well, uh, you're being guided because you see she's holding, you know, that fire there and she's being guided through darkness. So I feel like you're being guided through any situation that you may feel is unclear. You will be guided through it. Your new circumstance energy is the Queen of Swords, Gemini, Libra and Aquarius. This is a no-nonsense type of energy right here. This is very direct, very straightforward, uh, very realistic, okay? Uh, this queen, whether you're male or female Taurus, she does not spare anyone's emotions, feelings. She cuts through any BS. She doesn't make decisions that are based off of emotions. It's all logic and reason, okay? So, and it, there's a fairness here. There's a clarity. There's a truth. So, I feel like by the end of this week, Taurus, if you've been in a situation, uh, maybe involving work or friends, where there has been any type of disagreements or confusion, disloyalty, you're going to be cutting uh, situations or people out of your life, okay? Because you're going to do what's right and what's just for you at this time. All right, Taurus, remember, you see all those orbs and all that bright light. This is what's surrounding you at all times. Spirit is with you. Remember that. You're being guided. Uh, this may be a week for purging. Purification activates vibrant life force. And I feel like uh, you are already in the process of this. You have an, an overabundance of love being showered upon you. Unconditional love. Uh, this is also, you know, your cup runneth over here. So it, it's just being very blessed at this time. Ten of Pentacles as your current situation is a beautiful energy. There's stability. There's security here. You have a new beginning and clarity and truth about which direction you're going. There's a victory. There's some type of achievement that's moving you forward. Uh, success at this time. You know, strength here, you're very courageous, you're moving forward, you're going after a dream, you have the self-confidence. And, you know, you know that you're being guided uh, along your path, whether it's the dark night of the soul or 
just listening to your intuition here, listening to your dreams, listening to the nudges from spirit. And you're ready to walk a path, I feel, that is going to be what's just for you. And when I say that, I mean, you're, get, you're ready to cut off or cut out any situation or person that's not serving your best interest, Taurus. You're ready to take care of you and do what's best and just for you. All right. Instead of praying for an outcome, I pray for the highest good for all. Beautiful, Taurus. All right. I love you guys. Please leave me a comment. Let me know how these energies are playing out in your situation, Taurus. I send you all my love, wishes, and blessings, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye, Taurus.